Hey guys, welcome to my channel. It's Tia at B5 Designs and I wanted to come on and share a Dollar Tree and Dollar General haul. I did this video once. I talked too much so it was getting a little bit long. So I thought I would just refilm it and see how we do. Um, so I went to Dollar Tree over on the other side of town. Let's see. I have one, two, three, four Dollar Trees that I can think of in my area, probably within like 20, 25 minutes of each other. I don't know if that's like for everybody or not. But whenever I go into Dollar Tree, I always pick up whatever, usually at least five rolls of these. I use their double-sided tape a ton in my junk journaling. Um, you guys know I do the composition notebook junk journaling. I do have a couple that are like, how do I want to say, they're they're complete, but I need to put pictures in them. So the picture part I haven't done yet. So I will be working on that. And I know I say this a lot. I haven't been crafting um, really too terribly much. I haven't really felt good. I had gotten sick back at the end of January and I just really have not completely bounced back from that. Now this Dollar Tree had these and I, I want these to set along here because I have baskets now, which you can't see because I have my directions for my Empress setting here because I was working on um, some stuff. And um, I just thought maybe these would be more space saving for me. Um, I had hunted for these which I did get and I was going to cover them and I probably still will. Um, and these ones are, the green ones obviously are bigger. And I do, I know they had one or two other colors, but I don't remember what they were. Um, so I am still going to cover these um, with some paper that I love eventually, you know. Got to make all these plans and then got to find the time to do it. So I did get three and I, you know, I have like my pokey tool, this one. I have a pokey tool that I made. I have like sequin spoons and stuff like that, that it would be just more convenient for me to have here rather than like not very far away right there. <laughs> but because you know how we are when we craft, we just tend to put things down and then before you know it, you can't find it. That's what happens to me anyway. I'm sure a lot of other people do that. So I'm going to set those right there. And again, those are Dollar Tree. I did, I always try to pick up packing tape because I always need packing tape for something. I do use it a little bit in my junk journaling. Um, for like binding kind of and then I picked up I try to stay away from the ribbon but I did see these and I'm going to use them on my Valentine's candy poppers now I had gotten the candy popper die and I've been working on cutting them out some out these ones are not very big however um, Muriel from Ms. Cooper's Coop pointed out that if you happen to have the um, Close to My Heart Artiste cartridge, I believe it is, which I have, they do have the bigger ones. And if you pop over to her channel, you'll see hers. They're very nice, very big. And of course, like she's the ultimate bomb in decorating anything and layering and all of that stuff. So, um, and I'm sure you can get the SVG cuts too of them. But um, right now I'm just working with the small ones. And then um, I got this and my plan, I am making some stuff for my sons for Valentine's Day, like a goodie basket or whatnot. And then I'm not gonna show you like a bunch of non-crafty stuff, like household items that I, got everybody kind of knows that you can get that kind of stuff but I did pick up and I thought I had another one because I thought there were four colors of this now the yellow has the ducks 
super cute. And the orange has the carrots. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh my goodness. And then the pink has the gingham bunnies, which I thought was cute. And then I think there's a fourth color, but, and I thought I grabbed it unless I dropped it out of the bag, which with me, anything is possible. I try to take stuff out of the bag, but you know, because I know people don't like to hear the crinkle wrinkle. Anyway, they have these in pink and blue, but I chose the purple. Purple is my mom's favorite color. So I this year have found that I lean towards purple. Um, I got the bunnies and you get 12 felt stickers in here. And it looks like, let me look. Oh, okay, I see. So you get, cute, cute, cute. You get um, the face. Oh, he's kind of wonky. You get the face. And then you get um, the coordinating feet. How cute is that? I didn't realize that when I bought them. So there you go for that. Cute, cute, cute. I haven't been to uh, Dollar Tree for I don't know, a couple of weeks. I don't know. I really don't know. I say that and then I'll go and I'll be like, oh, I was there last week. Um, so I did get those. And then I picked up these which are super adorable as well. Love the little bunnies. I'm like, oh, I'm... you guys, I haven't even done my tear trade for Valentine's Day yet, and I don't care. I'll do it this weekend, probably, and then I'll leave it up until I feel like doing Easter. Oh, here's the other color. This one has purple, and then I think this says Happy Easter. Yeah, it says Easter. I don't know if it says happy, but it says Easter, the middle one, and then the Rick Rat. I don't have any business buying any kind of trim because I have a ton, and I, like, purged my craft room. And I'm going to be... No, don't, don't think that my Christmas stuff is still up because it's not, but I do have some to actually pack away still like my trees down and all of that kind of stuff and I'm gonna kind of go through and purge some really really old Christmas decorations that I never use out of that and I don't know why I'm telling you that but oh so I have a lot of Christmas like crafting stuff still sitting out here in my craft room because I want to kind of my plan for 2023 was to kind of Christmas craft as far as like card making all year long. I haven't done it yet. Um, so anyway, I got the felt sticker carrots and then I think, oh, no, I did get, um, it's the only Valentine thing I think that I got. Well, other than the trim and I'm going to do some baking and bake some goodies for my boys and then I got this little Easter bunny, of course, for my junk journal. And I don't know if I showed this, which is not like life altering if I didn't, but I always try to pick up packing tape when I go to. And then um, I got these stickers. I haven't seen these before that I recall, and I thought they were really pretty, and with spring coming, <laughs> it's not even Valentine's Day, and I'm talking about spring. And then I picked up these. Um, I haven't seen these before. I mean, I think I may have seen somebody haul them, but as far as in my stores, and you get 16 sheets of each design, and so there are the designs. Super cute. The rabbit will be cute for... Um, Easter and then they had this one and this one just has some you get two of each and it has some different um, like positive aff aff affirmations make each day your masterpiece one of them says um, I'm not gonna show them all but the question isn't who is going to let me it's who is going to stop me 
I like this one. Savor the moments that are warm and special and giggly. That's so cute. Okay, so I think that is it from, well, I did pick up some little snackies to have in here. And then whenever I go to Dollar Tree, I always pick up a bag of this. This is really good. Um, sweet and salty kettle corn. I like that. And then I went to Dollar General. I have been, now I live in a town where we happen to have, I couldn't even tell you how many Dollar Generals, a lot. Like on my side of town, I can think of two. And then there's one in what we call downtown. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. So anyway, our town, I don't know if every town is like this, but we have like downtown Sioux City. Then we have Morningside. Then we have Leeds. Then we have Indian Hills. And then you get into an area called North Sioux City. And it's actually part Sioux City and part South Dakota. And then it's like a tri-state area. Then we have South Sioux City, which is in Nebraska. So I have easy access to a lot of stuff, you guys. Um, except we do not have a local craft store. The only thing we have is a Hobby Lobby and a Michaels. And let me tell you, we don't get, like at our Michaels, anywhere near the good stuff that I see some of y'all get. No Tuesday morning, no Joann's. Um, so yeah, it kind of sucks. So anyway, I went to Dollar General because I've been seeing people posting about... Um, they're going to start carrying some more craft stuff like Pebbles brand, some, I think I even saw crate paper, but I'm not 100% sure. Mine does not have any of that yet, but I could see where they're prepping for it. So what I did pick up to put in the Valentine's little goodies, I picked up this Rainbow Nerds um flavored lip gloss my daughter-in-laws seem to like that kind of stuff and I did pick up for my junk journal um, one of these cards you guys know I um, sometimes I will glue the card shut and just um, use the envelope as the card base and then a lot of times I put pictures of my grandkids inside of it in my junk journal so the inside is not of importance to me. And then this one with the little ducks says with lots of love. This one's an Easter one. And it's hard to find them without something on the outside, but that's okay. Cause you can cover it up or you can leave it. It doesn't matter. And then this one says, thank God I'm an Irish setter, which that I will probably cover up. But, um, on St. Patrick's Day, everyone is Irish. But again, I'll put a picture or something there. I think that's a cute idea. I did pick up another composition notebook because I am getting ready to start prepping for, let's see, I have January, February, March. So it'll be April, May, and June in this one. Um, this is the reason why <laughs> I felt like they're prepping for getting their... Um, crafting stuff in. They had a section that had three packs of scissors and they very much looked like mm, a set that I got similar to this, but it was a three pack. Um, this brand is West, Westcott, but I had gotten a set from scrapbook.com and it has three sizes in it and I love it. And this set that they had is very similar to that. Um, and I love it and my honeybees. Um, anyway, and then they had these, but of course I couldn't, well, they had an M for my grandson's first name, but it was orange. So I was like, yeah, I don't want to get an M for miles, but they didn't have an H. So for Hudson, so, but they had an M or an E for Ember. So I went ahead and picked that up so I can do something cute with her and, her mommy has gotten into scrapbooking. So probably because I take forever to do anything. Oh, as you can see, this video is very long because I talk too much. I did get this in the $5 section at Dollar Tree and it just says Easter on it. 
so I did get the bat and then I did pick up some they had these um, Valentine brownies those will go into the goodie bags they did have some blossom top Reese's I've never seen these before so I picked up some of those and then I picked up some milk char milk chocolate caramel duet hearts the kids kind of like that they're really good about sweets and then I picked up a hairbrush um, so that's that you guys I should get off of here I'm gonna come back and show you what I picked up at Amazon for uh, my little grand kiddos um, sorry I'm rustling paper um, ah, Valentine's so I will be right back 